Well, let's let's uh, take a specific instance of this to try to clarify things for for me and for the audience. A program like this. Mm -hmm. Now, there, there are images of you and me going out there. Uh, we're also talking. Mm -hmm. What's the message? The uh, message, uh, in uh, the sense that the. Uh, whole effect of uh, the medium of TV upon them is this, that with TV, the audience becomes the screen, not the camera. They pick us up um, by way of being the screen. We impinge upon their senses as uh, the movie image impinges on the screen. Mm -hmm. They are the vanishing point. Mm -hmm. And uh, the effect of being the receiving end or the vanishing point of imagery, the exact reverse of the movie, is to turn people inward in depth, meditatively. Well, this is, if I understand you, this is a rather uh, a sad moment, though, because here we are engaging in what we hope is a cerebral process, and the part of it that's a cerebral process really doesn't matter much, does it? Hold on, let's say that. Uh, the, uh, the, uh, what is happening since TV is that the cerebral is becoming much deeper, more profound, than it had been before TV. Ah, now, now this, this deeper or, or profounder thing, uh, what, what is deep about getting a, some sort yeah, of right. impression of us as opposed to understanding what we're saying. What is uh, deep in psychology as compared with just psychological classification? It consists in relating things to one another that unexpectedly. Depth it does not mean making profound observations. It means relating perfectly obvious things to perfectly obvious things. Uh, depth is a matter of interrelating. TV is a profound depth medium because it interrelates rather than isolates points of view. Uh, instead of isolating a small aspect, a tiny splinter of a situation, it creates a kind of iconic surround. Uh, that is why a TV is a very fuzzy image as compared mm -hmm. with movie. Mm -hmm. Now, the TV thinker may seem fuzzy because he doesn't have a point of view. He is mainly concerned with processes or processes I could keep when I step I come south of uh, the border I realize I have to change from process to process but TV is a profound process medium and in everything that's been happening to our youngsters since TV puzzling to their parents is this depth involvement in processes mm -hmm. which they cannot find in the schoolroom as I understand your analysis uh, this is a rather uncontrollable process. That is, that you and I really can't be sure by doing this, that, or the other thing that we are going to create this, that, or the other process out there. I think you can if you take time to study it. But um, you see, mostly uh, when people are uh, playing with TV, they think of it as, uh, in terms of the old medium, movie. The, the content of TV is thought of as the movie. And they don't watch the TV form, therefore they don't attempt to control TV. They control the movie form while using TV. But if this is a, a kind of um, almost poetic relationship between the, the, the people on TV and the audience out there, uh, it does not operate according to mechanisms which are totally understandable by a rational process and therefore are not controllable, are they? I think, uh, on the contrary, it's uh, very controllable, very understandable if uh, attention is paid 